Hey guys, this is Carson Cloud. Welcome back to my channel. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to deploy hardware updates in SCCM using third-party tools. So you can deploy manufacturers, um, BIOS update, video card updates, uh, USB updates, any kind of hardware updates that, that is provided by the manufacturer. And it's really simple to do. Let's go ahead and get started. Go to op open up the um, SCCM console here. I go to administration. I'm administration, so I'm going to software library. And under software library, um, you go to third party software update catalogs. So you want to make sure you enable third-party software catalogs by going to administration and um, site configuration. Right-click on your site server and go to site configuration software updates point. And under third-party updates, you want to make sure you enabled it and set your certificate I you can follow my um, my first video on how to enable this so if you have a question just uh, put in put your question in the comment section and I'll link you the video how to configure the software update so now let's get started again um, enable third party uh, not third party but the um, manufacture hardware updates So by default, Microsoft gives you catalogs for Dell, HP, and Lenovo. So you have to subscribe to these manufacturers. Again, um, the other video I show you how to do that. So let's let's do that for um, for this manufacturer, Lenovo's. So what you need to do is right-click on Lenovo and go to subscribe to catalogs. That's fine. Click next. Click next. View certificate. That's fine. Click OK. I'm going to check the box. Click next. And next. And close. Once you subscribe, you have to right click again and then go to sync now click yes you want to make sure the last sync status should say yes oh, I'm sorry should say success so you can view the log um, of the status the log file is it is called um, SMS something let's see SCCM logs It is SMS underscore ISV updates sync agent. You can open up these logs and um, view the sync status. As you can see, it is syncing. Once it's finished, you have to go into click on all software updates and then run the uh, sync synchronization software updates. So we're not going to go through that in this video. I'm just in this video. I'm just going to um, show you how to deploy any manufacturer software updates or manufacturer hardware updates. So if I type in updates here, if I type in uh, Dell. I can see all the drive for Dell. Since my environment is virtual machine, virtual environment, I don't see any requirements. So if I want to deploy BIOS, BIOS updates. I can choose the BIOS 
package I want to install. So what you need to do is right click on the um, the package or the title. You have to go publish third party software updates. Once you do that, you're going to have to look at the log file again. Make sure it's finished. When it's finished, this icon should turn green. When it's turned green, that means you can deploy it. So when it's finished here, you have to force the software update again. It's uh, quite a bit of uh, steps that you have to do. So once you, soft you force the software update, it's going to turn green, and then you can deploy just like uh, any other Microsoft update packages. So right now, if just say if I want to, de to deploy any of these, I'm going to get an error. Don't you see that? So you want to make sure they turn green first before you can download and deploy. So that's it, guys. Thank you for watching. And if you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And have a wonderful day.